Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to talk about the shake hands rule. This rule is important in the quantitative section of the GAT or Qudarat exam. So I guess you can think of this video as kind of like a lesson. Uh, it's followed by practice problems. So let's just get started. Okay, so the formula is the number of handshakes is equivalent to N. N is basically the number of people um, and multiplied by N, which is the number of people, minus 1, all divided by 2. So let's see this formula in action. Okay, so uh, it says, after a meeting, 20 attendees shook hands with one another. Calculate the number of handshakes. Okay, so we have 20 attendees, meaning this is the number of people, 20, and then... Uh, we put 20 minus 1 uh, in between parentheses and then we divide it all by 2 which means 20 times 19 multiplied or I mean divided by 2 and 20 times 19 is 380 and then you divide 380 by 2 equals 190 meaning our answer is B 190 people uh, or 190 total number of handshakes um, now let's go and apply what we learned. I want you guys to pause this video and attempt uh, to do this problem yourself. Okay, I hope you guys attempted to do this problem. The question says, in the, the question says, in the composite figure below, how many triangles are there? So, all we have to do is simply count the number of lines first. So we have, uh, so we have... So we have one, two, three, four, five lines. Or in this formula, we can use it as like five number of people. So five, uh, and then five minus one divided by two. And it's five times two divided by two, or I mean five times four divided by two. Five times four is 20 divided by two equals 10. And our answer is simply A. These are how many triangles uh, that are in the composite figure below. Okay, now let's move on uh, to question number two. Uh, this is a similar question, so pause this video and try to do this yourself. So, it says, in this composite figure below, how many triangles are there? So, again, we count how many lines there are. How many lines are there? Let's take a look. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On the top triangle, there is seven lines. Oh, I don't know why. Let's take that. There are seven lines. And an easy way to solve this is to separate this into two triangles, which is going to make it easier. So two triangles, which is going to make it easier uh, for you to find it with the uh, shake hands formula. So we have one, two, three, four four lines okay and below we have four lines okay let's uh let's try it out so we should apply this in two different triangles so let's get started uh, the first triangle has seven so the first triangle has seven and then we're gonna apply it seven minus one divided by 2, which is 7 times 6, which is 42, and then you divide it by 2, divided by 2, what's 42, divided by 2, it is 21, it is 21, but, 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 we're not done, now we have to do triangle number 2, so we're gonna write 21, and keep it in mind, and then erase this, in order to have space, so we can just do this, okay, triangle number 2 has 4 lines, so we have 4, uh, times uh, 4 minus 1 divided by 2 and then it's 4 times 3 and then divided by 2 and 4 times 3 is 12 divided by 2 which is 6 and all we have to do now is simply add 12, uh, 21 uh, plus 6 equals 27 and our answer is simply D that was really simple now let's move on to our third and final question so it says there are 45 people in a room if each person asks to share everyone else's hand exactly once how many total handshakes would there be 
there's 45 people so we're just gonna simply apply the rule 45 and then 45 minus 1 and then divide it all by 2 what is 45 times 44 simply we just have to do a multiplication because I don't really know this one from the top of my head so 5 times 4 is 20 and then 4 times 4 is 16 um, uh, plus 2 is 18 and then Four times five is again 20 and then 16 and 18 so you is this is our answer here so we're gonna divide this by two and then that is going to give us so 1980 divided by two equals 990 meaning our answer is C uh, we have completed our um, lesson today about shake hands rule. If you guys have any questions, please, please, please don't hesitate to comment it down below or even email me at whizworks at gmail.com. Whizworks YT, excuse me. I wrote my own email wrong. So it's whizworks. Let me write it above. Whizworks YT at gmail.com. I seem to have wrote, have wrote my own email wrong, which is not very smart. So if you have any questions, please, please, please don't hesitate to email me or comment down below. And yeah, this is WizWorks. See you in the next video.